For the first time, Royal Caribbean Cruise Lines is telling its side of the story and releasing video of a toddler's deadly fall aboard one of its ships. The child's grandfather, now facing criminal charges, spoke exclusively with David Begno in November. And David has the new images that raise questions about the family's version of the story. This grainy video shows little Chloe Wiegan running toward an open window that was above her head aboard the Freedom of the Seas ship that was docked in Puerto Rico last July. Her step-grandfather, Salvatore Anello, is following her. What happens next is critical. Mr. Anello leans over the railing for about eight seconds. He then lifts Chloe up and appears to hold her over the railing for nearly 34 seconds. The 18-month-old girl then disappears. Royal Caribbean, which the Wigan family has accused of negligence, says it should bear no blame. Rather, the cruise line blames Anello, saying he was reckless and irresponsible and the sole reason why Chloe is no longer with her parents. Puerto Rican authorities have charged Anello with negligent homicide. He told us in his only network TV interview last November that he never realized the window was open. All I know is I was trying to reach the glass and I know that we leaned over to uh, to try to have her reach the glass and at that point she slipped. She slipped. But at that moment, did you realize there was no glass? I didn't realize there wasn't any glass till the absolutely it was too late. Tonight, the Wiegand family has responded. They are asking a judge to remove that video from the public record. David Begno, CBS News, New York.